we looked up to Interpol for for guidance on our security concerns. And with Interpol putting up IGCI here in Singapore, about a few hours flight away from Manila, that is a big assurance. The impact that has been created by the mere presence of the center here in Singapore is, has redounded to the benefit of the entire ASEAN region. The ASEAN region is known as a, a prime spot for that, that security concerns might crop up. And the number of the growing population, the growing restlessness in some, in some uh, extremist activities, with the Interpol coming over through the IGCI in, in, in Singapore, we're better off than what we were five years ago, four years ago, security-wise. People will have to understand that we're an archipelago. Uh, a year ago, we were the last count was 7,125 islands. You, you won't believe it, but we, due to technology brought about by geo, geo mapping, geo tagging, and the advances in mapping, they discovered 400 islands more. We're 7,500 islands, and all, all of them are potential border crossings. The, the, the challenge will be for how to secure the borders, and the best, the best way to secure borders is through data, technology. The data was provided by the EU, uh, Interpol, ASEAN collaboration, provided to us by this office. And we, we, this, this coming year, we were hoping that we could expand our coverage from the seven major international airports and seaports. We, if we could double the, the implementation and the, and the technology provided to our field offices, much more the, our borders would be secured.